Hello, my name is Caitlin, and I'm here today to show you how to make a quick and nutritious breakfast. Today we're going to make oatmeal. So to start with making the oatmeal, we take three quarter cups of water to make one portion, and we let this boil in the pan. Once the water is boiled, we want to remove the lid, and we want to add one third a cup of oatmeal. Today I'm using large flake oatmeal, which takes about 14 to 16 minutes to cook. But if you're using quick oatmeal, it only takes a couple of minutes. So be sure to, to note which kind of oatmeal you're, you're making and take a look at what the back of the bag makes. Next, we want to add our toppings. Today, I'm going to add a quarter cup of blueberries and I'm using frozen blueberries because they're quite cheaper than uh, fresh berries and they last longer since they can be thrown in the freezer but you can add any kind of fruit you want, strawberries, berries, apples, I like bananas as well. So today I'm going to put half a cup of blueberries in. Next we want to add our protein source. Today I'm going to add a quarter cup of these walnuts, but you can really add any walnuts you like. And I know some people even like to put peanut butter in their oatmeal, so two tablespoons of peanut butter is great as well. So I'm going to add that in and stir it and since these oats take about 15 minutes to make I'm going to let them simmer in the pan um, uncovered for 15 minutes once the oatmeal is done cooking we can pour it in our bowl This is optional, but I like to add milk just to cool it down a little bit, and I find that it makes it a little bit more creamy. Um, you can use any milk or milk substitute that you like. I like to pour just a little dash in, about a quarter of a cup. And that's it, that's how we make oatmeal on the stove top. A quick and easy breakfast that's delicious and nutritious. A lot of people may, may not realize, but you can also make oatmeal in the microwave. To make that, you use two thirds a cup of water for one portion. We pour this in our microwave safe bowl. We add one third a cup of our oatmeal. For this oatmeal, I'm, making, I'm using large flake oats and in the microwave they take about four minutes to cook. Next, I'm going to add my half a cup of fruit. In this oatmeal, I'm using my blueberries and I'm going to add my quarter cup of walnuts and I'm going to put this in the microwave first for two minutes after the two minutes that is up we want to take our oatmeal out of the microwave and give it a stir and put it back in for another two minutes or less depending on what type of oatmeal you are using. You can take a look at the back of the pack for further instructions. So I'll add another two minutes. Once the last two minutes is up, we can take it out of the microwave. And again, this is optional, but I like to add just a little dash of milk to cool it down and to make it creamy and we can give it a stir and let it sit for a couple of minutes and it is all done.